welcome to the story from Persia. Long, long ago in a faraway land where the days were hot and the nights were even hotter, lived a very, very poor family in the desert. All they had was a tent and very few belongings. But it was a very special day. It was Shabbat. Shabbat was coming and they didn't have what they needed to prepare for Shabbat. So the two little children, the littlest of the family, Daphna and Liav, told their Iman Abba that they would take a trip through the hills and the desert to get to the very mystical and magical spice market. And off they started on their way through the hot sand through the dunes. They were so, so thirsty. And Daphna said, Liav, quickly, hurry, we can make it. We must be back before Shabbat. And finally, in the distance, there they saw it, the spice market with the brightly colored tents and all of the flags waving in the wind. And they tiptoed into the spice market. And there was the dod. There was the man, the seller of all the miraculous, special, secret spices. And they said, excuse me, sir, we must get home before the Shabbat begins, but we haven't got the right spices for our very special foods today. He said, come with me to the back. I'll show you where I keep my very special Shabbat spices. And Daphna and Liav, went to the back and he opened the biggest barrel and there were spices of all colors. There was red and blue and green and purple and he scooped up a very big handful and he gave Dasna a package and he gave Liav a package and off they went back to their house through the sand dunes, through the heat of the desert and when they got to their house, their very little tent, they opened up flap and they said, Ima, Abba, we've got the spices for our very special special Shabbat. And Ima looked at it. She said, you brought me purple? You brought me blue? You brought me red? I don't know if this is going to work. What shall we make? And Daphne and Liav said, let's make a special soup. And they mixed water and vegetables and Liav put his spices and Daphne put her red and blue spices and they mixed it and mixed it. And the most glorious soup came out, smelling so fantastic, they tasted it. <gasps> and the spices worked. It was the most wonderful Shabbat soup of all time. And everybody drank the soup, and they said the blessings, and it was the most wonderful Shabbat. Until we meet again back in Persia.